God damn, I've got to turn it on. Ugh. Let's see if this is on. It should be. It is here. What is going on, Sama Gang? It is your boy, the one and only Jay Sama with the llama, always starting that drama. Alright, y'all, we is ready for tonight. It is Saturday night game time where we always introduce the undercard of the underrated superstars of ICW. So we ain't gonna waste no time and we just gonna get right into the show. Starting things off with the first matchup, we have the former ICW World Heavyweight Champion Drew Flows taking on two time ICW Galaxy slash United States Champion Shade in a one on one. I think this is the first time I ever seen these two even fight each other one on one. So we're gonna definitely expect some crazy action to go down. been out of action for a while now but he is coming back starting off small to come back to bigger and better things that is the way of Drew Sensei and he is going to live up to his hype we'll see how well it takes him And here comes his opponent. And his opponent from New York, weighing in at 228 pounds, Shane. The Emperor of the Abyss. There is nobody like Shade. That man is definitely considered one of the top-scaled, most dangerous 
wrestler is inside of that ring and he can throw down like anybody else. When it's all said and done though, Shea would definitely leave you in the ring a piling mess. Like like a literal like pile of mess, like breaking bone bro broken bones and everything. Starting things off, Drew immediately going in with the with the backbreaker on the leg, and he hits it a third time. That's a strong trifecta. Oh, now Shade is up. Now Shade. Irish whooped into the corner. Oh, Drew able to counter. Oh. Irish whooped again. Yeah, what is going on, Jester? How you feeling, my boy? Hope you having a lovely Saturday. Hope you enjoying your weekend, my man. Ooh, ooh, Drew able to counter that. But Shade immediately going in with the elbow. He's definitely working the body right now. I'm gonna went to a fan expo. That's fire. I'm actually uh, in September. I'm actually planning on going to my first uh, either a Comic Con or I don't know what kind of convention it'll be. But my brother says it's a Comic Con and he's taking me to Chicago to go see it. So I don't know, man. I'm probably I'm excited, bro. You know, it's one of the first times I ever went to something like that. So who knows? I'm. Oh, some might go. Some might go right. <laughs> oh, Shade now taking the advances with those kicks to the back. Yeah, it's probably the same thing. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm picturing it. Is. Overall, if, if it goes fire, bro, I'm just excited for it. That's it. That's all it is. It's my first one I ever went to, so I'm ever going to. My bad. So I'm, I'm pretty excited. And Drew now going back to the well again with those backbreakers. He's trying to trying to make sure Shade hurt. Oh, Shade now with a counter. Oh, and now hurting that wrist. That joint manipulation specialty Shade is all about. Oh, counter and now going for the pin. One, two, and a kick out at two. Drew now trying to focus on what he can hurt about Shay right now. Oh, putting those elbows straight to the ugh, straight to the face of Shay. Oh, hits him with an axe handle. And now Shay able to counter. And oh, there he goes. There goes Shay trying to go for an X plex, but. Drew able to counter it. Oh, he hit him with that knee. And then, ooh, drops him straight into the mat. Uh-oh. I think Drew was trying to go for uh that crucifix power bomb. But a monkey flip by Shade. And now Shade going straight to the top rope. Double stop to the chest. Kick to the back. No. Nope. Uh oh. There goes Shade. Those stomps to the back. That kick to the face. Oh, he's he's pulling back on that arm. He's definitely hurting it. Oh, here he goes. Ugh, hurting the fingers now. And the double knees to the back. Now going for the pin. One, two, and a kick out at two. Drew is still in this matchup. Shay now frustrated. He's trying to focus on what he can he do. Ooh, 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 my lord. And then that right hook to the face. 
Try to go for a double stomp, but that did not work well in his favor. Ooh, a chop. Oh, sends him to the outside. Ooh. Right, Drew sending now shade to the outside. Ooh. I'm trying to definitely damage his leg. He keeps attacking that same leg. Oh, Ooh, drops him on the barricade. And send him straight into the barricade again. And now do torment to the crowd. Now Drew steps out of the ring and resets the count. Uh oh. Try to go for those backbreakers again. Shade able to counter now. Oh. Drew still taunting up to the crowd. Shade now getting back into the ring. Oh. Wait a minute. Shade could probably pull it off. Does he have it? Shader. One, two, and oh, almost close. And now Shay going back to the top rope. Hits a double stomp to the chest or to the gut. It's another one. Oh, a bro kick. A bro kick by Drew. Is this over? One, two. Three and Drew picks up the win. Drew definitely an amazing battle against Shade if he comes out the winner. Drew definitely says he's time to come back into becoming a world champion once again, and that might be his first step. All right, we focus on the next matchup. The YouTube champion, Ray, takes on AJ Price in a one-on-one -on -one bout. Surprise, Ray doesn't have a serious challenger coming after him for that YouTube championship yet, but who knows? Things change over time, so we'll see what happens. But overall, Ray has definitely been looking dominant with the YouTube championship on his waist. And there he is, the demon. He has a really long resume of titles. Former ICW Tag Team Champion, ICW Champion, World Heavyweight Champion, now current YouTube Champion. Men's have not only won every world title in both promotions but he is close to becoming a grand slam champion Ray is ready for competition like always. 
no matter if it's tag team or singles competition, Ray proves that he was the best among the rest. opponent the money maker AJ Price with a huge win over former cruiserweight champion the Don Eric last Wednesday He's feeling way too cocky. Saying he could take on the world. We'll see what happens here tonight. J. Price. Let the matchup began. Ooh. AJ Price with a counter. Ooh. Ooh. He's hitting Ray with every single thing he has. Oh, try to go for stomp. Ray able to roll out of harm's way. Roll over. Try to roll over into the DDT. But AJ Price able to counter that. Belly to belly suplex. Oh, you try to go for it again, AJ Price able to counter. AJ Price hit him with every combo in the book, a sling blade into a drop kick. Oh, try to roll over into another DT, but AJ Price just gonna keep countering it. He knows what he's doing. Oh, oh, try to go for a double stop to the chest, but that was not gonna work. Oh, uh oh. Oh, oh, gaining momentum is Ray, a sling blade. And I goes for a pin. One, two. And the two count. Oh, and now Ray. It's nineteen sixteen. Oh, is he setting up? Is this over for AJ Price? Try to go for the end, but that did not work. AJ Price able to duck out of the way. 
Ooh, slam right back down. Ooh, AJ Price with a counter. German suplex. You know, ooh. Those hits to the back definitely hurt. Those hits to the back definitely hurt. Now you pulling on that arm. Ooh, neck breaker. Now stomping on that leg. Now AJ Price gonna go to the top rope. Ooh, hits an elbow drop. Oh, try to go for a move. Ray now able to duck our counter. Uh oh. Ray now with the clover leaf locked in, but it's a rope break. Ray tried to set something up, but AJ Price able to counter. Oh. Yeah, uh oh. AJ Price setting up for something. What he's gonna hit? He's got that modified surfboard. Now he's got a pin. One, two, and a kick out at two. Now AJ Price, wait, he's locking in the submission. He's got the sharpshooter locked in. He's got the sharpshooter locked in. Is this gonna affect Ray in any way? Ray growling for pain, but he's able to counter. That definitely does hurt the back, but Ray able to counter right into a German suplex. Ooh, hit him with the elbow. And the elbow stomp to the gut. You know. Oh, Ray going back up to the top rope. Oh, he hits a missile drop kick. He's gonna go for the pin. Does he have it? One, two, and a kick out at two. Did he just hit the, he just hit the end. One, two, and a kick out at two. Ray, Ray is literally in his head right now. What is it gonna take to end AJ Price? What is it gonna take to put him down? Ooh, right into the corner. Oh, oh. Washing his face with his foot, Jesus Christ. Now pulling back on that arm. Oh, a neck breaker. Counter by Ray. Nope. Try to go for a move, AJ Price able to counter. DDT. Uh oh. What he setting up for something? He setting up for that modified surfboard again. Now going for the pair. One, two. And a kick out at two. This has definitely been a tough matchup for both men. Uh oh. Ooh, the STO. DDT by Ray. Now hurting that arm. Now punching the face of AJ Price. And now he busted him open. He's bleeding on the inside. 
He's playing on the out. Uh oh. And a brain buster. One, two, three, and Ray wins the match. That was definitely a tough one, but Ray able to manage and keep hold of that U2 championship. Wait a minute. Wait, that's Shadow. Shadow just walked out and it looks like now he's threatening Ray for the YouTube championship. Oh my goodness. Ray has just been called out. Is he really going to set that up? I guess so. But overall, good luck to Ray. Whenever that happens. All right, we move on to the next matchup. We have a debuting star. Last Wednesday, we had Coco Jasmine could debut in a tag team match with Nikki Nanami taking on Star and Palasinki. Even though the match was unsuccessful for her and she took an L, that did not break her spirit. So tonight, she goes one on one with Miss Diamond of Curla Coated, the same team that she managed to help win three world tag team championships so we'll see what happens here tonight and see if jazz is ready to walk the walk and talk the talk Coco definitely has that unique fighting style that probably might put her over the edge on most of her opponents, but overall, she can definitely hold her own. But we'll see how much she can do that here tonight. And she goes one on one with Diamond of Color Coded, who can definitely also hold her own without people having to help her as well. Diamond, the manager of the greatest tag team in history, color coded. She's definitely had a huge rise on helping those two, helping those two legends of the ring. So we'll see what happens when she holds her own here tonight by herself. Jazz, Diamond, let the matchup begin. Ooh, Jazz starting off strong with punches and a drop kick. Beautiful combo at, to begin this match. Now Diamond trying to go for a run and tackle, but Jazz able to block it. Oh, sends that straight into the corner. Hits her head off that turnbuckle. Ooh, ooh, ooh. A punishing, severe combo in the corner. Jesus. That definitely looked like it hurt. Diamond now countering. But Jazz is able to counter as well. Double stomp to the chest. They want to bring Diamond back down. Neck breaker. Ooh. 
I'll try to go for another move, but Jazz is able to dodge out of harm's way. Send her back into the corner. Ooh, Diamond now with a counter. Uh-oh. Eat defeat by Diamond. Now Diamond going top rope. Ooh. It's hit to Diamond. Oh my goodness. Try to go for it. Herakarana, but that just turned into a straight up flying leg drop. It wasn't pretty, but it also was effective. It, it was effective. Uh oh. Yeah, oh my Jesus. It looked like it hurt. Oh my lord. Sabi, the homie. What's the word, gang? How you feeling? Hope you having a. Oh, I don't know what day it is for you. Saturday, Sunday. <laughs> I don't know. Jesus. Drop kick to the back by Jazz. Ooh, trying to go off the rope, but it did not work. What's going on? How you feeling? Uh-oh. Ooh, plants her face first into the mat. Oh, it is Sunday for you. Jesus. I forget you always a day ahead. A splash. How you feeling, gang? What's going on? Ooh, the Southern Light Driver by Diamond. One, two, and a kick out. I'm good. Just finish the cursing. You were streaming? I didn't even see that. My bad. Oh, my Lord. One, two. Ooh, and a kick out. That was close. Dang, I didn't know you were streaming. My fault, gang. Should've, I should have low-key was looking. That's on me. That's on me. Ooh, try to go for a split-legged drop. That did not work. I mean, what was it? I mean, I'm interested in, like, learning new stuff, so. Oh, of course. My friends do that stuff all the time, so. I kind of just grown to, like, liking it. So, hey, it's not really a problem. Uh oh. Yeah, my friends uh do that all the time. Uh I have a friend um I met through one of my friends in college and she does like a lot of witchcraft and she's actually like done this ever since she was like five, so it was it was crazy. But overall it's it's pretty nice. Oh Lord See, I didn't that cross face. Yeah, it was very cool to learn. And I'm glad she's my friend and not an adversary. That would have been terrible for me. <laughs> oh, Jazz going to the top rope with Diamond right there. Ooh, a drop kick straight to the face. I'll go sleep now. Good night. Good night, Savi. Thank you for stopping by always. Much appreciated. You know what? Let me let me go ahead and do this for you real quick. If it works. Alright, there we go. No shit. That's weird. My stuff ain't working. Okay, there we go. Jazz in the counter. What is going on here? Oh, a DDT from Diamond. She was able to counter. Oh, stand up back up. Drops her face first into the mat. And now a pin. Wait, she just stopped for some reason. What, what was the stop for? One. And a kick out at one. Neck breakers, you know, spun around and everything. Jazz now able to counter. Uh oh. She's got that cross face locked in. She's got it back locked in. 
Diamond with nowhere to go. The rope is right there. I don't think she's going to be able to reach it. Oh, but Jazz lets her go. And now with the pin, one, two, three. And Jazz was able to put Diamond out of commission to win this match. Jazz winning her first match, and it was a singles match nonetheless. Let me not do that again. <laughs> That was an excellent match for Jazz. Definitely able to put her on the map now. All right, we move on to the next matchup. It is a tag team match featuring the ICW Women's Champion, Darth Cater, and her new partner, Star Moo, along with Leon in the corner, taking on the team of Sunshine and Tanya Young. Ever since the breakup of partners happened for a championship they have been looking for separate partners now and it seems one of them has found one and likes a star move so we'll see what happens when this newly profound team takes on these two upcomers i call them <laughs> Start this match. That is the women's champion for you. Very tough and eager. And now her partner, driven to become the best. Kicks faster than lightning. combination of power and speed with this team I don't know I actually do kind of like this pairing but we'll see what happens when they both collide tonight sunshine Definitely the calmest and purest person in the roster. You see many other wrestlers in here are probably as chaotic as ever. 
but it's always something about sunshine that just keeps her positivity going that just keeps her in her head and not lose sanity at all people like that <laughs> that are just as positive as sunshine when she steps into that ring it is all smiles when she steps out it is still all smiles surprisingly but her partner is definitely different from that Tanya Young will go on to be the most underrated superstar in ICW will go on to win the only one battle royal outlasting 19 other women in the division then go on to final destination last season and uh, realize her dream and become icw women's champion she was definitely untouchable for a minute at the start but then when the rebuild happened everything ha changed <laughs> Alright, so we see Sunshine and Darth Gator start off this matchup. Leon at ringside watching. Uh oh. German suplex by Sunshine starts this off. Another bridge suplex. Sorry. Ooh, a neck breaker. And now hurting that foot, that ankle. Jesus. Ooh, a strong suplex. Oh, uh, ooh. And now Tanya Young has been tagged in. Now she's going to the top rope. Try to go for an axe handle, but Kate able to read that one. Oh, Tanya Young now on the offense. And ooh, driven her to the outside. But now Kate able to pick her up and throw her onto the barricade. Ooh. Oh, throws her way up into the sky and now starting to throw down. Ooh, pulling back on the head. Oh, since Tanya Young back on the inside. Oh, stopped her from reaching sunshine. Oh, counter. Oh, try to go for a submission. Can't able to counter. Oh. Ooh, drop kick to the face. Oh. Ooh, another drop kick. Lisa and throws her across the ring. I able to counter again. Tag the in star. And now star is in the match. Ooh, a tackle by Tanya Young. And now Sunshine has been tagged in. I'll try to go using those kicks, those strong kicks. Ooh. Ooh. Those kicks definitely gotta hurt. Now Sunshine now. Puts her in the corner. Oh. They're now choking her from the middle rope. Now 
Now attacking that arm. Oh. Oh, my Lord. I think you call that an underhook German suplex. Now going for the pin. One. Oh, they ain't even account. Oh, sunshine now. Hurting that arm a star. I think she has a strategy in mind. She's got strong legs. She must have weak arms. Ooh, slammed by Tanya Young. Oh, got to go in using those legs again. Jesus. Oh, and now Star with the comeback. Gaining the momentum. Ooh. Stomp to her leg. And now going for the pin. One. Two. Three? What the? D d wait a minute. What? H huh? D uh, that, that had to be the quickest. What? That's the quickest tag team match I've ever seen in my life. I, I guess it worked. Congratulations. What the? Who loses it under the match wasn't even match wasn't even that long bro no what all right we, we gonna move on to the next match it's <laughs> oh my god <laughs> that match bro was it even that long it was a tag team at McCry. We move on to the next matchup. Bane versus Nick Taro. Bane's tag team partner Lotus will be in action main event as he takes on Dabi Uchiha. Right now, Bane is right now focused on his singles career. And he's going to see how well he does against a former world tag team champion. Longest reigning tag team champion, actually. And the likes of Nick Taro. Alongside his colleague and the closest friend Sage oh yeah main is one half of Twitch Tag Team Champions E-L-O-S. They live by that code of conduct. And here he is. Known as the 
Dark General. Nick Toro ready for competition. As he takes on Bane. Alright, the match is beginning. Nick Taro now. Starting off with a sharp combo. And oh. Coming down. Bane now countered. Now he's going in with the attack. And oh, a suplex by Bane. Now going to the top rope. Hey yo, what's good Mafia? How you feeling man? Hope you're having a lovely Saturday. Ooh, Nick Taro with those punches. Highly severe. Ooh. Chilling how you I'm good man. I was uh I was doing a bunch of stuff today and I'm kinda tired. But I was like, you know what, I'm not gonna I ain't gonna cancel tonight. I'ma I'm gonna show some love and do the show. Oh my Jesus, a drop kick to the outside. Nick Taro taking control of this matchup. But yeah, I'll have a bunch of stuff going on. So I was like, you know what, I'm gonna finish all this real quick and then I'm gonna stream. So yeah, I'm just luckily I'm able to sit down for now. <sighs> oh. Ooh, and those couple little punches by Nick Taro. Ooh, sends him into the stairs. Oh, that's good. We appreciate you being here. Man, thank you, bro. I appreciate that. I appreciate you guys stopping by to always watch your streams, bro. It's, it's, it shows it shows much love. I do appreciate y'all 100% always, bro. Oh, is that an A count? Bane now runs into the ring. Oof. Oh, Nick Taro. Hits him on that turnbuckle and throws him like a rag doll. Oh. Oh. Now Nick Taro with the stomp to the joints. Oof. Ooh. And now Nick Taro going for the pin. One. Two. And a kick out at two. Try to go for the knee drop, but Bane able to roll out of harm's way. Ooh, a counter. Ooh, another counter by Bane. Bane now. I'm going crazy right now. Now he's hurting that arm. Oh. Now sweet butter leg. And now going in with the ground and pound. You're now going to the top rope, Nick Taro. Looking into the skies with that elbow drop. And now another pin. One, two, and a kick out at two, bang. Oh, and now Nick Taro calling for it. Is he gonna land it? Is he gonna land that? He got reversed by the RKO. Oh, and now Bane throwing back to the outside. Nictar said you was doing too much. Now I gotta do it to you. What is he gonna do? Try to go for the axe handle to the outside, but he missed heavily. Oh, and now Bane now on the offense. He's now just circling the ring. Trying to find out what next spot he can get him. Oh. And now Bane with the lumbar check. One, two, and a kick out at two. Ooh, 
Ooh, kick to the back. Now pulling on that arm. Try to go for a knee drop, but that missed. Oh. Ooh. Ooh, a tornado DDT by Bane. Does Bane have it? Does Bane have it? He's gonna go for a second. Lumbar check. Now he's got the pin. One, two, and a kick out at two and a half. It was close. It was close. It was close. They ain't now trying to hurt that arm. Trying to make sure Nixara has no advances against him. Oh, he tried to go for it, but he was able to counter that one. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, my God. He hits him with the punt kick. Oh, his head might be out of place. R K O strikes. And it's a rope break. Oh, but now Bane now. Oh, trying to go for a move. It did not work. That body drop. And now going to the top rope is Bane. What does Bane have on him? Frog splash. Now going for the pin. One, two, and a kick out at two. Ooh, the knee drop. Oh, Bane's got it. If he can get it, this might be it. Oh, this might be it. The third lumbar check in this match. Is this over? Does Bane have it? One, two, three, and Bane wins the match. Bane got the luck of a draw here tonight. It was a close one, but it definitely came down to who was the better man. Now, ladies and gentlemen, we move on to the next matchup. We have Blue and Ace, known as Order of Sun Chicken, taking on Shadow and Kit Kat, my own Sama Gang bros. We'll see what happens here in this tag team match. Ace and Blue trying to get into the tag team division, but... Let's see if they'll be halted by these two individuals here. One second. Give me one second, guys. I'll let the entrances play, but I'll be right back.
Jesus, ah, I'm back. What have I missed? Okay. All right, kick and ace. Let's kick that head on turnbuckle. Oh. Oh, kick out now able to counter. He gets a chop. Sends ace to the corner. Ooh, not hurting that leg. Oh, kick at now able to counter. Ooh, ace on the advantage. Oh. Ooh, drop straight on his head. Oh, suplex. Oh, and now Kit Kat able to make the tag to his partner. Blue and Shadow definitely have a rivalry. Before, when Blue, I mean, when Shadow fought Blue for the World Heavyweight title. Oof. Oh. Ah, that hurt. Choking the life out of Shadow right now. Now, Shadow. He was able to counter with a knee straight to the face. Oh, and the stomp puller. Stomp puller in the leg snap. Oh, now going to the top rope. Is he going to go for it? He went for the diving leg drop instead. Oh, he's going to go for that signature shadow strike. That elbow drop from the top. And there goes the pin. One. And a kick out at one by the world, by the former world heavyweight champion. I'm dead. Oh, atomic drop. Oh, and he's squatting with them. Jesus Christ. Blue with a show off. Standing suplex. Now he tags in ace. Shadow better hurry up and make it to the other side. Attacking Kit Kat, and there he goes. Oh, nice. Ooh. Kit Kat with a counter. Ooh, that big boo. Now bust the ace open. And now he's going in for those punches. Ooh. Oh, that had to hurt. Oh. 
Sending him into the corner. Ooh, a chop. Ooh, ran straight into him. Ooh, and now Ace. Trying to get a little bit of that revenge. And ooh. Drops him back on his head. Oh, wait a minute. Trying to go for the future shock DDT, but Ace. Oh, that body drop. Now tags in blue. Uh oh. Blue now. Ooh. Ooh, he tried to go for a move, but oh, it wasn't pretty, but it was effective, though. Now I'm going for the pin. One, two, and a kick out of two. Now he's gonna go to the top rope. Got to go for that knee drop, but he missed by a wide margin. Oh, hurting that arm. DDT by Blue. I mean, DDT by Shadow. Now kick out at one. Oh, counter. Oh. And now Ace is tagged in. Russian leg sweep. Not going to the top. And there it is, the shadow strike. One, two, and a kick out of two. And now kick has been tagged in. Ooh, a baseball slide. That was a massive one, too. Oh, you rolled out of harm's way with that one. But kick out now, he's with a counter. Shadows and tap back in. Oh, try to go for a DDT. That did not work in his favor. Set up Shadow for the Cow Crusher, but it's a rope break. I don't know what's going on. I guess now you're going for a pin. And the kick out at two. Oh, he's setting him up. Send him up. Ooh, countered by Shadow. Uh oh, wheelbarrow roll. It's been one, two, and a kick out of two.
Oh my goodness, Boo just bulldozed Shadow off of the ropes. Oh. Trying to go for another move, but it's countered. Jesus. Now Blue's tagged in. Oh, 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 that's hurting. Jesus. And now going to the top rope. Oh, and Kit Kat just pushed him off. Oh, try to go for a tornado DT. That ain't work. Elbow dropped by Blue. And now stepping on the hands of Shadow. Ufu's kick. Headbutt. And the counter by Blue. Oh, he's gonna try to step on his hands again. Ooh. Oh, Blue send it back up. Is he gonna land it? Oh, try to land a glorious DDT. It did not work well for him. Ooh. He's now going to the top rope. Can he land it? Shadow strike for the second time. Two. And a kick out at two. And now kick out has been tagged in. Oh. Now going to the top rope, but Blue now aiming for Ace. Uh oh, try to go for the back suplex. It did not work well for him. And a suplex. Oh, oh, he hit him with a 450 off the ropes. Oh, the gut buster. Not going for the pin. One, two, and a kick out at two. Oh, DDT. Oh, 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 beautiful combination by Ace. Now he's setting him up. He's gonna try to land it. He's trying to go for the phenomenal forearm. That was a massive counter. Ooh, and that punch. Now Shadow is tagged back in. Oh, he's trying to go for a super kick. and not work well in his favor. Oh, eat defeat by eight. I mean by blue. I mean by Shadow. Oh my God. One and a breakup by blue oh oh blue with a counter oh ooh oh combination once again by ace now tagged in blue. Oh. Ooh. I know he's not gonna try to go for this blockbuster again after he missed the last couple times. Oh my god. And now he's going for the pin. One. And a breakup by Kit Kat. He threw him to the outside. Ooh. 
Knee strike to the face, and now Blue's busted open. Oh, he's trying to go for Glory's DDT again. It not work well in his favor. STO. Oh, the shadow trying to set up. Oh, blue with a counter. Oh! Ace now tagged in. Oh. Oh, the wheelbarrow. Now I pin. One, two, and a kick out at two and a half. And now Shadow going to the top. Can he land it? Shadow strike. One, two, and a breakup by Blue. Now blue going straight out the kick hat. So that leaves the two legal stars inside the ring, Shadow and Ace. And now Shadow, Shadow going for a submission maneuver with that cross face. And Ace taps out, Ace taps out, kick hat and Shadow win this match. Amazing, amazing pick of victory. And all right, ladies and gentlemen, we move on to the next matchup. We got Moon Mizuki taking on the undefeated primary Moon Mizuki, the second and current Twitch Women's Champion, seems to try to make her a better example or showcase as a true Twitch Women's Champion. But she is now about to take on the undefeated primary. Now, I don't know how long that streak will last but against someone like moon you'll definitely have to be on your toes moon is a pretty skilled high flyer she can do anything in and outside of that ring but primary definitely has power to her game if you get catching her clutches it is game over so this is definitely a battle to see and to see if moon is going to be having new competition when stepping up for that title. Because being champion means you have a target on your back from everybody, friend or foe. She is the Twitch Women's Champion. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from New York, the professional internet wrestling champion, the Princess. Moon is definitely on her A game. She has definitely kept her spirits up. She tried to do the best that she can. Something is bound to happen here tonight. And it probably might end up with Moon coming out on top. And here she walks down to the ring with that attitude, that charisma. Mary is definitely a force not to be reckoned with by the power that she indulges in that ring.
I can see why most women see her as a female. <laughs> see if she can keep that undefeated streak so far intact all right moon primary let the match up begin moon starting off strong with a punch and now going to Ooh, straight into the knee. That's a huge gut buster. Oh, now Moon claiming it, taking it up to the skies. And a drop kick wasn't all the way intact, but it was definitely effective enough. And now using her legs to her advantage. And now her goes primary. Using some of that power that she has. A hip toss by Moon. Count, ooh, roll by primary. A shoulder tackle. Now stopping her out, and now Moon able to catch the leg, leg sweep. Oof. And now she got a double knees. And then the knee to the back. Leaving it on there for an everlasting painful effect. Kick to the back. Uh-oh. Ooh, primary now able to counter. Moon now with a counter. She's definitely trying to stay on her toes. Uh oh. Wheelbarrow. Oh, what is Moon trying to go for? Moon hits up with a drop kick. Ooh. Ooh. The lunar combo at an earlier time than this? One, two, and a kick out at two. She pulled out the lunar combo way too early. I don't know. Oh, she's trying to set her up. Is she gonna land it? The Eclipse counter by primary with a Lariat. She thought that she was going to throw the primary off her game. She stayed on her toe for a while now. Now Moon trying to take primary to the corner. Almost worked for Moon. Now primary sends her to the corner. And ooh, that punch to the head. Oh. Oh, what is going on here? Oh, my goodness. One, two, and a kick out at two. That was a beautiful move by the primary. Had no idea what she just did, but it definitely was an effect. A stone cold stunner. It's a stunner. One, two, three, and the primary just won that quickly. She just pinned the Twitch Women's Champion with ease. I see what happens when power overthrows, overshadows speed. Moon, unbelieved at what just happened. Wait a minute. Pirate? Oh, Pirate trying to come after the Twitch Women's Championship as well. She now has her eyes set on Moon. There is no way that this just happened. And now she got two set of eyes on her target. I mean, on her championship. That's like I said, you can't trust everybody. But that was a crazy match. Primary still undefeated at 5-0. and oh, This is unbelievable. But we move on to the next matchup. The ICW Women's Tag Team Championship is on the line. It will be the Candy Girls taking on Bree and T who have held the title for a very, very short time of 23 days and still counting if they somehow manage to win here tonight. This is Bree's first women's tag team title but this is also but this is T-Raw's second time holding the women's tag team titles making her a two-time champion yeah Brie is this close to becoming a Grand Slam champion she has one title left on her list to claim and it is the ICW women's championship so we might be seeing 
something happening in the near future but for right now gotta start things off small but the candy girls have been trying to win the women's tag team titles for a minute now but can they do it can they be on the same page as Bree and T to win those titles Fun fact, actually, T. Raw was actually one of the one of the first people to hold the world women's tag team titles. Candy Girls got Sour Patch, Queen of the Ring, and her steam tag team partner, Sugarfoot. Both women are very skilled on their own as well in singles competition, but all they ever cared about, all they ever dreamed about, was holding those women's tag team belts. But they have to go through a very gamed Brie cosplays who's also ICW Divas champion and a two-time women's tag team champion T-Raw so this is definitely going to be a fun match up to see and I'm surprised to find out if the candy girls can actually surpass both of these women This is a crazy duo. We had no idea that this was actually going to be a combination, but they somehow managed for it to work and pull off an unexpected win to become the new women's tag team champions, pulling them off Brie and I mean Brie Brie and Lee Lee of Sama Gang, who have only held those titles for at least under a day, which is unbelievable. Ah, they're actually hyped for this matchup. They're ready to defend those titles. All right, the match is an Extreme Rules Tornado Tag Team match. All competitors will be in the ring at the same time. Weapons are allowed, and pinfalls and submissions can only happen inside the ring. So we see the Candy Girls right now. They are prepped up, and they are ready. They are focused for this matchup. But then you see their opponents, their adversaries, Green T, who are dead set on bringing back those titles. The women's tag team titles, they cannot get bigger or better than this. They have to be ready, they have to be strong, they have to be willed in order to bring back those titles to them. Alright, and here it goes. Oof. Ooh, an uppercut by T. And now Bree going straight for Sugarfoot. T. Raw actually did have a match against Sugarfoot Wednesday night with T. Raw pulling off the win, but Sugarfoot was not going to let that down. You're going to try to get her revenge one way or another. Oh my goodness. But I think now the Candy Girls now are taking advantage in this matchup. A sunset flip power bomb, and now Sour Pops using that joint manipulation tactic inside the ring. Oh my guys give me one second i will be right back once again <laughs> I, I won't be as long i'll be right back i swear
back, and I guess I see all the weapons now being involved. Oh my Jesus, wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. Ooh, the combination of attacks by Sour Patch. And now Sour Patch got that baseball bat, using it on T, using it on T. Sugarfoot going straight at the breeze. Oh my Jesus. And now the chair is being involved in, and oh my God, the stairs. And now T is in the ring by herself. She goes back out, trying to get Sour Patch. Bree going straight after Sugarfoot now. Oh, she said, forget the chair. I'm gonna use the baseball bat. And now she's nailing Sugarfoot with the baseball bat. Oh, trying to go for a super kick. That definitely missed. And oh my God, the slam. And now t raw using the steel chair on Sour Patch. Jesus. Oh my God, a super kick by Sugarfoot. Looks like the Candy Girls are definitely taking control of this matchup. Definitely control of the situation. Oh my God, a power bomb on the barricade. Jesus, that has to hurt the back. And t raw still using that steel chair. But now Sour Patch using that baseball bat now. Oh, ooh, a Spanish fly. T now going back into the ring. Is Sour Patch going to follow? Sour Patch follows. Oh my goodness. And oh. Try to go for the Aluva kick. It's a counter. Uh oh. Amateur wrestling takedown. Sugarfoot now. Sugarfoot try to go for a 10L DDT. That missed very, very wide. Ooh, that slap. I guess you try to find a weapon. It was no help. Now Sugarfoot rolls out of rolls out of the ring. Definitely a good strategy. And now Sour Patch got that baseball bat at hand. Oh my Jesus! Uh oh! A Canadian destroyer by Bree to Sour Sugarfoot on the outside. That definitely has to hurt. Oh, the running knee by Sour Patch. Is this it? Is this it? One, two, three, and the Candy Girls have won. They are the new women's tag team champions. They have done it. They have realized their dream, and they have officially done it. The Candy Girls once again reign supreme over the tag team division and are now the women tag team champions the titles that they have eluded their entire career have now finally been received they are happy they are happy they are proud congratulations to both women and i hope a successful long title reign for both women congratulations we move on now to the main event of the night Lotus, the Twitch champion, taking on Dabi Uchiha. Dabi, who competed in the million dollar eight man eliminator match on Wednesday, was unsuccessful and was nearly this close to becoming the new million dollar champion. Unfortunately, Leon was able to get a hold of the title, but Dabi has not given up. He has not lost hope. He is going to keep going and keep going and keep going until he receives another shot at gold that he's been wanting his entire life. But now he's trying to see if he can get it off of Lotus, the Twitch champion. All we know is Lotus has definitely been holding strong. He's been keeping home promises and he's been holding on to that Twitch title for a minute now. He's faced tough opponents. He's faced the likes of Musty. He's faced the likes of Coach. He's faced the likes of Drew. All who tried have failed to capture this title from Lotus. Can Dobby be the next upcomer for the Twitch championship?
Once you're in that guillotine, you is put to sleep. We ask Dobby, why does he pursue the title so much, or why does he pursue gold? And his opponent from the other side of darkness, weighing in at 186 pounds, A S A P. Like I said, we ask Dobby, why does he pursue gold so much? He said, I'm happy for Spirit that he's won the United States title. And he's happy that he has been having a successful career so far. Being a two-time Cruiserweight Champion is a lot of hard work. But I want to keep that going. I want to keep pushing myself far beyond limits that I can go about and finally receive what I've been wanting my entire life to become a respected individual in this business, to become a respected individual for this company, to show the entire ICW universe, I am no joke. Dobby stands by those words and he sticks with them for an entire lifetime. I'm very proud of this young man. He has put himself in a lot of matches to prove that he is ready. But is he ready against Lotus? Is he ready to try to take that Twitch championship off of the limitless one? All right, these two are talking. They're talking before the match. Oh. It looks like Dobby pushed him. And now Lotus set off. He's ready. Oh my God, he's going straight for the leg. He's going straight for the heel hook. But Dobby able to push off. Dobby started this off with a push. And now Lotus is, Lotus is angry. Oh my God, that knee strike to the face. Counter by Lotus. Ooh, elbow straight to the face. And now kick to the back. Oh. And now Dobby with another knee strike. He's trying to keep Lotus down. Lotus is going to try to get back up as much as he can. Oh my goodness, Lotus with a counter. Kick to the back. A second one. Ooh, ooh, oh my goodness. And then that kick by Lotus. Oh, ooh, the stomps to the chest. Lotus has definitely had enough. He is definitely upset with the fact that Dobby pushed him before the match. These two were having a great conversation before they even started. And try to go for a drop kick, but Lotus missed by a little margin. Ooh, but that did not stop him. He's going to keep going. Dobby now counters. Ooh, and then a moonsault. Ooh, and the knee drop. And now the basement drop kick to the back. Try to go for another double stomp. And now Lotus. Oh, it's got Dobby. Throws him on the ropes. Uh-oh. And now that triangle lock. That triangle lock. Lotus is trying to pull away so much power out of Dobby. 
trying to make sure he loses breath, but Dobby stays in it, and he is toughening it out. Ooh, the chops, chops, not a leg. And, oh, he drops him on his arm. And then a standing moon moonsault by Dobby. And, oh, is Dobby gonna land it? Lions barrage! And it's a rope break, his foot touched the rope. And now, Dobby going straight to the top rope. And trying to go for a drop kick as well, he misses. Uh-oh. And now Lotus with the brain buster. Holy Benoli. One, two, and a kick out at two. Dobby stays alive. We don't know for how long. How long is this going to keep up? Oh, he there he goes. He's got it. He's got it. Can he lock it in? He locks it in. The guillotine. The guillotine. That submission could put anybody out. He's trying to hold on. Dobby trying to stay strong. He's trying to hold on. Oh, wait a minute. I don't think the submission's working long enough for Dobby able to break out. Oof. And now Dobby. Ooh. Dobby gaining momentum. Can he keep up with it? There he goes. And now he goes for the pin. One. Two. And a kick out at two. Oh, ooh, a kick straight to the face, and now Dobby's bleeding. One, two, and a kick out at two. Ooh, that knee strike to the gut, and now a knee strike to the back. Uh-oh. Ooh, dropped him on his head. Uh-oh. Oh. Is Dobby trying to set it up? I think he's got it. The internal Mangeko Sharingan. Two. And a kick out at two and a half. Ooh. Lotus. Lotus with those hits. And now the knee... And then a kick to the back of the head. Uh-oh. He's got his arm. He's got his arm. Arm drag. And out of pin. One. Two. And a kick out at two. Dobby's still strong. Staying strong in this match. Oh, no. Oh, no. If Lotus catches him. Lotus got it. Lotus got it. And he's going to lock it in. And he's got it, the guillotine, guillotine, arms so close to the rope, I don't think it's gonna happen. Dobby couldn't take any longer. Lotus makes him tap out. A beautiful matchup by these two individuals. These two definitely might have a start in their rivalry, but overall, congratulations to both these men putting in a tough show, but Lotus always will pull out with the dub. All right, ladies and gentlemen, that is the end of Saturday night game time. Thank you all for stopping by. I appreciate each and every single one of y'all. You already know I'm going to be back tomorrow for COD Day if I'm not tired, but probably will be. But, you know, I'm going to keep I'm gonna keep it going because I love each and every single one of y'all. But it's, speaking of which, we're going to go ahead and end this off with a raid. We're going to go raid one of my boys, my boy Shade, who's streaming Dead by Daylight right now. So if y'all want to go by, show some love, show them that uh, Sama sent y'all. But you guys already know, Alexa. Alexa, Alexa, 
disconnect the vice. But you guys already know, Sama Gang, staying strong, and Sama Gang out. Yeah. <laughs> I right, see y'all later, gang.